Hey everyone, in this video we're going to go through the third and final bag of Lynch Mining's Black Label. Uh, I'm going to open it up, show you the dirt we're working with, classify it out, and then draw the magnetic side of it. Uh, like I said in the previous two videos, make sure you have a magnet when you go through this. If you, if you get the Black Label, uh, make sure you, you, you have a, a magnet to uh, draw these black sands, or the magnetic stuff out of it because it would be a nightmare if you didn't. Uh, you definitely don't want to have to pan this stuff with the, the magnetic stuff still in there. Um, make sure you stick around at the end. I will post uh, what we found in bag one, two, and three and give you the uh, average return on investment for uh, all three of these bags. So, uh, look forward to getting through this stuff. Here is the third and final bag. Hopefully it will open up better than the other two have for me. It did. So, this looks like a familiar, uh, a familiar sight here. These look just like the first two bags. Uh, really fine, really small stuff full of magnetics. And there's a piece of gold, and there's a little piece of gold. So, yeah, it has some good gold in it. Actually, I see several pieces of gold. So, uh, we'll get through this stuff, and... Uh, I will uh, classify this stuff and uh, I'll show you the classified material when I get done. Well, here's the material broken down in its different classifications. The plus 16, which uh, most of it looks like gold. The uh, minus 16 <laughs> plus uh, 30. The minus 30 plus 50. The minus 50 plus 100. And then the minus 100. So I'll draw the magnetics out and then I'll show you that broke down as well. Uh, this is the plus 16. I think there was one little piece and I just, I just threw it in there with this uh, minus 16 plus 30 uh, mag uh, magnetic stuff. So that's your... Uh, Minus 13 plus 30. Minus 16 plus 30. Um, I'm not positive I, I said that right. And that's your uh, magnetics that go along with it. And this should be your minus 30 plus 50. That's your material. And there's your magnetics for it. And that's your minus 50 plus 100. That's your material. That's your magnetics. And there is your material for the minus 100. And here are the magnetics for the minus 100. Now I'll go on and pan out all of the material and then uh, do the magnetics after I clean up everything. And, uh, cause I usually don't find much of anything in the magnetics. So um, we'll do all the material first, clean everything up, and then we'll do the magnetics and see if we find anything in there. And this is uh, the gold that we recovered from Lynch Mining Black Label, the third bag, third and final bag. And the gold spot price for today is $1,275.50. So that's the spot price we'll be using. As soon as this stuff dries, I'll weigh it on out and uh, I'll show you guys and girls that. We are back and we the gold is dry and so we're going to weigh it out. Let's uh, throw this on the scale, tear it out.
and we got 1.172 for our final bag that's 1.172 grams of gold I figured I'd show you another little quick video um, now this is the third bag of the lynch mining I think that's the first I can see that little big nugget in there and that's the second bag now this is all of the gold that we've let me put it out here this is all of the gold that we've uh, found so far in the previous six bags and I'm just gonna add this stuff to that So, so far that's what we've found in nine bags of uh, pay dirt. Um, honestly, don't remember how much it is now. Uh, but I can figure it out and I'll let you know when I uh, do a little screen recording and, and show you uh, the return on investment for the other. We are on silverrecyclers.com. Uh, we're at their gold calculator. Uh, we're using U.S. dollars. The gold spot price is $1,270.75. Uh, we uh, weigh everything in grams. Uh, we're going to go to 24 karat gold. And yeah, I know this isn't, uh, isn't uh, 42 I mean, 24 karat, 42 karat, 24 karat gold. Uh, but I like to be consistent with every pay dirt bag that I do. I uh, always uh, use 24 karat gold. Uh, punched in 1.172 grams, which was the amount in the third and final bag of Lynch Mining's uh, black uh, label. We hit calculate, it gives us $48.06. We go over to our calculator, we punch in 48.06, and we're gonna divide by 69.1, which is the average of the bags that were on sale that we bought, the three of them, plus the shipping and handling, divided by three, that gave us $69.10. So we wanna divide by that. And that gives us 69.55% return on investment, which is pretty good. That's uh, pretty high. So we want to figure out the uh, average return on investment for all three bags combined. So we're going to add the 69.55 plus uh, 71.27 plus 69.1, which was our first ROI. I thought that was funny after I noticed that uh, the cost of the bag and the ROI was the same on the first bag. So we get a total of 209.92 divided by 3 gives us 69.97 which is almost 70%. So average. This is what the average is for the three bags. Uh, 69.97 which is really, really good. I mean uh, I'd say anything between 70 and 100% is great. Uh, anything over 100% is phenomenal. But uh, I hadn't hit one of those uh, while I've been actually recording these yet. But uh, hey, if you like the videos, make sure you hit that like button. If you had not subscribed yet and you want to see more videos like this, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And then click that notification bell and that will notify you every time I post a new video. Um, I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for watching. I hope you each have a wonderful week. Uh, this is actually the day before Easter. And then this will be about three or four days. Uh, probably four days after, uh, after Easter. Uh, before I posted this actual video. So... 
I hope you all had a great Easter. And uh, I look forward to uh, hearing from you guys in the comments. Please let me know of any pay dirt bags you wanna, want me to go through. If you want me to check out some equipment for you, I can do that. If you want me to, you know, uh, run through it. Now, I'm not saying I'm going to go buy a $10,000 dredge and, yeah, I'm going to try this dredge out for you. That's probably not going to happen. But, uh, you know, uh, if there's a certain piece of equipment that's, you know, not extremely expensive, I might buy it and uh, try it out on the channel. So... Just uh, make sure you leave some messages in the comments if you want to talk or anything. I try to respond to uh, all comments. So, thanks for joining me. And, uh, like I said, have a great week.